Blog Talk Radio. Shut that crap off, for Christ's sake. Anyway, sorry, folks. Let's go ahead and get to everybody's favorite part of the broadcast, folks. All right, and I'm talking about Radio Graffiti. <laughs> That's right, folks. Radio Graffiti, the part of the broadcast where the spectators become a part of the spectacle. All you've got to do is give me a call right now at area code 516-453-9903. And when I call on your area code, you've got exactly three to four seconds. Three to four seconds to say whatever it is that's on your mind. That's why we call this Radio Graffiti, all right? Uh, Hey, Engineer, do we got any goddamn Radio Graffiti calls to be had, man? All right, well, let's go ahead, and let's go ahead and get to some goddamn radio graffiti right now. (laughs) Anonymous radio graffiti, Twilly Atkins radio graffiti. I think the world needs more tards. And, you know, I mean, I know, I want those perverted little minds of those tards living a never-ending perpetual reel of them reading Matt Pony's stories and clopping. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about, man. (laughs) (laughs) You sick son of a bitch. Damn, Tony! God damn it, I'm getting infested by bronies! God damn it! Uh, look, 
Enough of the brony stuff, please, all right? Enough of the goddamn brony stuff, please. Please! Please! Give me the freaking mic. Give me the mic! Jesus Christ, man. Please, man, all right? Please, man! All right, folks. Let's see who we have here for Radio Graffiti, all right? How about Anonymous Radio Graffiti? Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. Donald Trump is now the official president of the United States of America. And I, I just, I don't like it. They're, they're going to liberal it up, and I, I don't want to have anything to do with it. So without any further ado, let's bring up Uncle Bernie. I think that we've got him on the horn here. Let's go ahead, Uncle Bernie. Uh, let's go ahead and hear what you have to say about Donald Trump what I'd like Donald Trump to do right now is come over here and take your underwears off. That's right. Sit on my apple. Come on. Yes. 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 Uh, uh, hey, come on. Sit yes. on the apple. Yes. I want you to be very happy. Ah! Oh, you heard Uncle Barney. Oh, you heard Uncle Barney. All I want you to do is I want you to clean yourself up, Donald Trump. And don't tell anybody I told you to take your underwears off. Feel the boy. I'm running again 2020. Oh, you son of a bitch. Twilly, don't besmirch the name of President Trump, you freaking crony! Damn it! Don't besmirch the name of President Trump, boy! That's my president you're talking about now. Do you understand that, bronies? Huh? We president now. So don't talk about my president, boy. Give me the damn <laughs> Don't you understand that, bronies? We president now. <laughs> Jesus Christ. The freaking Helen Keller deaf me right off the bat, for heaven's sake. Anonymous radio graffiti. Twilly Atkin radio graffiti. My wife is the most disgusting, despicable, slovenly, ignorant, fat, disgusting, skankosaurus slut bag smelling up the whole goddamn city like a bad period. No more respect for my wife, all right, chaps? I'm serious. Don't respect my wife, all right? Can you imagine screwing the, you know, a fat heifer like this, for Christ's sake? I mean, that's work. That isn't enjoyable. You, you, you shut up, Twilly, you dumb, stupid broad! <laughs> shut up! You goddamn bitch horse! You goddamn bitch horse, shut up! Don't you dare! Give me the mind! Go shove a horse head up your twat! You damn break for Christ's sake, man! How about anonymous radio graffiti? Not only is my wife an embarrassment to the country, she decided to become a fat, disgusting, slovenly human being, and then on top of that, we understand each other's roles as far as our relationship is concerned, and I am beating my wife. I mean, this is beatings. This is closed fist taking a billy club beatings. All right? God damn it! God! God! Get the goddamn kid yet! God! Yeah! You piece of crap! <laughs> you dumb sons of bitches! Yeah! I would never do that! Stop talking about my family, you fucker! Stop talking about my family or I'm getting out of here! I'm out. I'll, I'll get out of here. I will get out of here, boy. Jesus Christ, you sons of bitches, man. Jesus Christ, you sons of bitches.
Christ, man. Give, give me the freaking mic. Give me the mic. Give me the mic. Look, I'm not joking a goddamn round with you sons of bitches. You keep talking about my family. I'm getting the hell out of here. I'm getting the hell out of here. Son of a bitch, man. I'm not even joking around with you sons of... Anonymous Radio Graffiti, Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. My little short bus, my little short bus, inner circle. My little short bus. Short bus, son of a bitch. My little short bus. The inner circle is serious business. I'm a daddy. What's up, man? I'm writing nice stories. I am autistic. It is I, the Teutonic Clay. Hey, guys, I'm Betty Hinkle here. My little short bus. Why don't you be one of those innocent boys? Right? You stupid short bus sons of Scumbags. You know what I'm going to do? I'm getting out of here, and I'm going to enjoy my Baller Friday. And I'm going to forget that I even did this broadcast today, you scumbags. Jesus Christ, man. Anonymous Radio Graffiti. Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. It's been a little over a month since my inauguration, and I want to take this moment to update the nation on the front. I've made in my administration what we are witnessing today is terrible organization. We have the worst president in 65 years. As thousands of citizens now came here, we will keep our promises to the American people. We cannot allow our nation to become great again. Uh, you know what? Uh, you know, we're not we're not going there, right? What did I say? Don't intertwine politics with the Saturday Night Troll Show, you son of a bitch. I don't want to go there. Do you understand that? This is a completely different forum. Don't go there again. Or I'll end this goddamn broadcast. It's Saturday evening. Do you understand that, boy? I mean, I could be out millitime somewhere right now instead of commiserating with you idiots. All right? You know what I'm going to do. I really want to be at a bar right now, but I don't think I'm going to be able to go to a bar because you idiots have freaking just literally made me physically and violently ill, and I hope that you idiots are so proud of yourself about it. But I'm going to pretend that I'm at a bar here, for Christ's sake, all right? I'm going to pretend I'm at a bar here, all right? And you know what? You know what? You, you dumbass, uh, you, know, you know, you bronies, you CIA bronies out there, all right? Let's put on a song for you stupid dumbass spooks, all right? Uh, yeah, yeah, you, you, the cyber division of the CIA. And by the way, folks, I was actually attempted to be hit up on one of my personal computers. I've actually got a whole bunch of computers in separate. I don't want to get into my setup. Anyway, uh, I found an unusual attempt at trying to put a executive file on my computer <clears throat> And uh, I found it rather coincidental that uh, they, the method for which they use smells like CIA all over it, for Christ's sake, all right? I'm serious. I'm not even joking around. It smells like goddamn CIA all over it. But luckily, um, I've got Penix 2.0, and the CIA, uh, let me tell you, they don't, they don't stand a chance against Penix 2.0, all right? I'm telling you, right, they don't stand a chance against Penix 2.0. Anyway, 
I, w- I wish I was at a bar. It's a baller Friday here. You people have ruined my show anyway. I'm probably going to take this show down so that the historical record sh- will show that this show never existed. So with that being said, I'm going to pretend that I'm at a bar here. And let me tell you, since I got a lot of you brony CIA bastards, let's put a horse head song on. How about that? You know, and let me tell you, this is a song that was really, really popular back in about 83, 84. You know what I mean? I mean, you went to any disco at that point in time, baby. I mean, you know, uh, women were shaking their assets to this particular song, baby. You understand what I'm saying? All right. I'm not joking around, so let, without any further ado, let's go ahead. You got the, the, the song engineer? Mm-hmm. All right, let's go ahead and put it on here, all right? What do we have here? Is it on? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. A little bit of laid-back 1983, baby. Uh, yeah. Uh. Who cares if I'm sick to my stomach? Uh, there's nothing like some beats, you know, you're, woo, woo, woo. There's a little bit of laid back 1983. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Yeah, we're at the disco, baby. How's it going? Hey, what's going on? Everybody's coming in. What's going on? Let's have a toast, baby. We're partying. That's right. Donald Trump is in office, baby, and everything's great. <laughs> Cheers, baby. Cheers. It's a baller Friday. Whoop, whoop, whoop. If you want to ride. Uh oh. Yeah. We'll ride the white horse. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do you want to ride? Uh oh. Uh oh, ride the white horse. Uh oh, uh oh. White horse. Don't ride the white horse. Uh oh, do you want to ride? I ride the white horse. Hey, let's give everybody a round right here, right? Hey, let's get everybody around and put it on that guy in the fox suit that has the AIDS this tab. Put it on his tab. Ah. Yeah. If you want to ride. Ah. Ah. Uh, ride the white horse. How oh, you like that? Ah. Put it back on, engineer. If you want to ride. Yeah, ride the white horse. Give me my drink. Baby. Another round. Get another round of drinks going on. And put it on the short buses tab, all right? They got mommies and daddies or somebody paying for their way. Put it on their tab, baby. (laughs) Don't ride the white horse. Don't ride the white horse. Oh, yeah, Baller Friday. I hope everybody's enjoying their goddamn Baller Friday. At my expense, you people have made me violently ill on my own show, for Christ's sake. Oh, get down. Oh, oh, yeah. Move around. Move around. Shake that pressure off, baby. Woo! Woo! If you want to be rich, you got to be a bitch. I say rich. Bitch. Oh, 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 oh. All right, let's get another round of drinks going on. Let's get another round of drinks. Who's picking up this one here? If you want to be rich. Here, let's, let's put it on Eeyore's tab, all right? Bitch. Let's put it on his tab. Bitch. Oh, ghost. I don't have the money, ghost. Hey, right, well, go and get it. Go and get it! We're drinking here, go and get it! Hey, you know what? Okay, since Eeyore can't pay for it, we're putting it on 727's tab. That's what we're doing. Hey, yeah, man. 
I'll pay for it, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, you see, he'll pay for it, baby. Give him the tap. Shut that song off, for Christ's sake. All right. Now that we've gotten all that, that was fun, for Christ's sake. I'm pretty sure that every one of the bronies are feeling funny in the pants because they never heard of that horse song, huh? Huh? You never heard of that horse head song? <laughs> Woo! Well, you know what? Let me tell you something. That was a very, very popular song back in the 80s. Very popular song back in the 80s. And uh, back then, the white horse... The white horse uh, meant uh, cocaine. Uh, I, I, I know, I know. That's how the 80s was, folks. That's how the 80s was. So when you hear that guy, do you want to ride? Ride the white horse. He's talking about if you want to do some cocaine. That's what he's talking about, all right? All right I'm, just, I'm just saying. I'm just saying, Okay. Anonymous Radio Graffiti. Willie Askin Radio Graffiti. Do you want to ride? Ride the white horse. Do you want to ride? Ride the white horse. White horse. Ride the white horse. White horse, ride the white horse. No, no, no! Ride the white horse. No, no, no! Ride the white horse. Do you wanna ride? Ride the white horse. Do you want to ride? Ride the white horse. Do you want to ride? All right. You know what? I'm sure the bronies are all having their assholes puckered up with their horse heads up it, saying, Yay! Do you want to ride? Uh, Ride the white horse. Hey, asshole, the guy in that song is talking about cocaine, all right? He's not talking about shoving a horse head up his ass. Good God. How about anonymous radio graffiti? If you want to be a red horse, you've got to be a red horse. Be a red horse. Red horse. You, you, you shut up, Twilly, you dumb, stupid broad. Shut up. Yeah, you know what? Real funny, Tweely. Yeah, real funny. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Anonymous Radio Graffiti. Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. What was that? Some kind of a furry costume or some crap? Raiding Snake, what do you have to say about this? On my spot. No, 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 no,
Guys are sick, man. Anonymous Radio Graffiti. It's about time for everybody's favorite part of the broadcast, and I'm talking about this. The San Hambonio. <laughs> <laughs> Rangers, Ghostly Soros is attacking San Hambonio. Call your Zords and combine. Zord Buzz. Light Power Ranger, Aryan Unicorn Sword. Fight the up. Rum set. Boots is Crusher. Vibrator. Power Rangers. Zord Force. Cyber Worm and Mega Sword. What the hell is that? All right, team. Now let's show this Hambone what we're made of. Right. Shove it up your ass. Three screw impact, Rangers using Ken Stop Lee. Activating Tamperella Force Field! <laughs> nice thinking, Blue Ranger. Now it's our turn. White Ranger, use your love and tolerance laser. On it. Activating body teleport! I'm in your spit. I'm done with the body. I'm done with the body. I'm done with the body. Good work, Blue Ranger. Keep pouring it on him. I'm not going to let you win. I'm not letting you goddamn win. He's using a toad magnet. It's pulling us in. Perfect. Pink Ranger, what are you doing? Oh, I get it. Time to finish this team. Mega Black Ranger, Ranger activate. activate. Black Ranger, as soon as we approach him, grab his ass and turn him around. We'll do. Steady. No. Excellent work, Rangers. What the hell was that, for Christ's sake? Jesus Christ! I mean, what? I'm what? What the hell am I doing here? Putting up with this kind of crap? Honestly, I think there's something wrong with me. You know that I'm just continuously coming up here over and over and over again, taking this kind of crap. What was that, man? Give me the mic. You fuck, sh- sh- I'm sorry, man. You people got way too much goddamn time on your hands. You stupid freaking freaks, man. Uh, once again, I personally believe it's a social component that is driving a lot of these folks into these weird, perverted uh, fanatization of uh, these cartoons. I think it's. I think it's disgusting. And look, right now I'm getting tweeted at by a bunch of sick-ass bronies like this idiot Scarlet Moon and, uh, you know, all these other people out here, Twilly Atkins and Alt Furries Unite and all these other people tweeting at me. And you know what they're tweeting at me? These sick, disgusting, shocking type of pictures. And you see, that is not, there, there's nothing funny about that. There's nothing shocking about that. What it says to me, that you should be on a fucking sexual, uh, uh, a sexual predator database. That's what it says to me. Excuse my French, I'm sorry. I just think that people that think that, uh, you know, sexualizing cartoons is somewhat of a joke should be on a sexual predator database. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, especially a cartoon that was initially geared towards little girls, I strongly believe that if you're going to sexualize these cartoons, I personally believe that you you belong in a goddamn uh, uh, sexual predator website, man. I'm not even joking around. Three, five, two, radio graffiti. Twilly Atkins, radio graffiti. I am Princess Molestia, and I I love ghosts. How am I, sexy ghost? I am not your baby. Oh yeah. I want to screw your stupid idiot Dankasaurus slut bag. Pony hats off, and I know he can do it. I know he can do it. What the hell was that? What the hell was that, man? Damn Twilly Atkins, you bitch horse! Jesus Christ, anonymous radio graffiti. Twilly Atkins radio graffiti. What 
Cleveland show theme. You guys are freaking racist. And you know what? That's not even a guy. That's a girl, for Christ's sake. You're racist, Twilly. You goddamn bitch horse. 352 Radio Graffiti. Most power rangers have destroyed my puppets. But wait till they get a load of me. What the fuck? Death to America and capitalism. Looks like the air of poops has finally shown its true colors, Rangers. It's morphing time. One tedious morphing sequence later. Power Rangers, Power Force, Power Force, Power Force, Power Force, Power Force, Power Force, Megazord, Megazord activated. All right, team. Let's cut the shield's funds. Yeah. Well, if it isn't the mighty charming Power Rangers, just who I was expecting. <laughs> no chit-chat, Kabob. White, yellow, fire your weapons. Right. LNT laser. <laughs> You fool! You think I wasn't expecting that? They have no effect on him. He's not as easy tricking as good, huh? My turn. Ruben, hot! We'll have to try something else. Try this on for size. Heroes have come. (laughs) (laughs) Yummy. Launching Tar Taser. Like it first. That's all? I don't believe it. He caught the taser. And the rocket. Catch! Brace yourself, Rangers. Our sword is going down. This is hopeless. He's too powerful. Maybe I can help. Yes, Frog, go! Thanks, Kermit. No problem! Frog Zord Mega Hub! <laughs> what the? Get off me, you frothy ass frog! Now, while he's distracted. Turbo Boosters engaged! Hold on, guy! Sweet Allah! Stop humping my turbo, you pathetic freak! Excellent work, Ranger. I wouldn't count your eggs before they hatch, guys. Look, he's getting back up. Uh, it's now you've asked for it. Oh, hell. Ah! Impressive, but we got a final form, too. Kermit, time to combine our Zords. Okay, got it. Frog Zord combined. Megazord sequence has been initiated. Power oh, Rangers, Tall Force, Rudy S, Cyber it doesn't matter. I'll destroy you. Shekel Storm. <laughs> Activating anti juke Goyam Force Field. Try this on for size. It's fine, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Goes around, comes around. Now, Ranger, while he's down, hit him with everything you've got. <laughs> 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 Let's finish this, team. You know what to do. Radio Vibrator, activate. Oh, engaging thrusters. <laughs> Not this time, Rangers. Self-destruct sequence initiated. If I'm going down, I am taking you with me. We have to shake them off or the explosion will decimate the entire city. Don't. Don't. Activating Yes, let freedom reign. I'm glad the Arab prince is dead. I'm happy. I'm happy your kebab. The wild Jehudi ass is dead. Huh? Whoa, you die. Whoa, whoa, you die. Whoa, you die. Whoa, whoa, you die. Whoa, you die. Whoa, you know what? Get that shit. What? What the hell kind of a slice was? What the hell was that? What was that crap? Uh, uh, what? What the hell was that? What in the blue hell was that? I mean, how much time? I mean, uh, oh my god, man. Oh, how much time did that... 
You guys got a lot of freaking problems, man. And did I hear Dermot and the African booty scratcher in that goddamn splice? How much time do you have on your hands, for Christ's sake? Give me the mic! <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. I'm just, what, the, what the hell was that, man? Anyway, we got anonymous radio graffiti. Twilly Atkins radio graffiti. How about Raiden Snake radio graffiti? <laughs> Hey, Raiden, you all right? What the hell's going on? Hey, Raiden, you there? I hear you're doing something over there. Are you fapping or something? Hey, Raiden? Somebody's saying that you watch anime. Do you watch anime, hey, Raiden Snake? He's a goddamn freaking anime watcher. Oh, man. No, why? 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 <laughs> what the hell was that? I mean, can you leave right and snake alone for Christ's sake? God damn you, man. God damn, can you leave the man alone? Leave Raiden and snake alone. How about anonymous radio graffiti? Let's just go ahead and get to everybody's favorite part of the broadcast. And I'm talking about Apple Bloom says the darndest things. Hi, ghost. I'm Apple Boom. I'm trying a new drink for the first time today. What was it called again? Johnny Walker, second harvest. Oh, yeah. Alrighty. <sniffs> oh, yeah. Tastes like pony piss. Oh, Jesus Christ. I mean, I'm getting infested by bronies for <laughs> Christ's sake. Man, you know what, man? Let me tell you something. I have been freaking followed around by bronies for, like, uh, since 2010. All right? Since 2010, I've been followed around by freaking bronies. It's 2017! Good God. Give me the mic. Give me the mic. The freaking damn mic. Anonymous radio graffiti. Twilly Atkins radio graffiti. Look, I want to be comp- I'm going to be completely honest with you. I've got a retarded granny. And listen, if there's anybody that knows autism, it's me. Now, I would like to say one thing to my granny. Okay, shut up and you put the helmet on your head and and, and don't say anything because you're retarded. Uh, and I, I'm just supposed to feel sorry for you. You want to know why I don't feel sorry for you? Because you are a ridiculous, uh, supposed. A pussy pampering goddamn cottage cheese thunder five old bag. And no one should feel sorry for you. And to be honest with you, I think that you should get the crap kicked out of you. I'm not even joking around. I'm not kidding. I'm not. God damn it. Yeah. 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 You piece of crap. Yeah. You see what you're making me do? It's your fault. God damn you, bitch horse twilly act. Stop talking about my granny! Son of a bitch! I don't know how many times I gotta tell you, sons of bitches, to not talk about my granny! My granny was a pious woman, and for you folks to besmirch her memory really pisses me off. I'm telling you, it really chaps my ass. I'll tell you that right goddamn now. Good God, man. Give me the freaking mic. Give me the mic. Give me the damn mic. Don't talk about my granny, boy. I'm warning you, man. I'm telling you. I'll end this damn broadcast there, boy. Anonymous radio graffiti. Twilly Atkins radio graffiti. Hey, Raiden! I think that you should get the crap kicked out of you. I'm not even joking around. I, I think the Raiden Snake may need a good trip to the woodshed. I'm not kidding! Yeah! I'm not kidding! Yeah! Yeah! You piece of crap! Yeah! Raiden Snake is gone now, all right? I, you should be happy about it. You should be uh, uh, feeling funny in the pants about it. Look, hey, hey, you bitch horse, all right? It's not funny, okay? 
I'm not very happy about what the what happened with Raiden Snake today, and I don't appreciate that you trolls are so goddamn joyful about it as well. All right, I lost a friend, man. I lost a friend. All right, anonymous radio graffiti. Hey, America, are you sick of the FDA always banning so-called legal highs? Are you tired of your state never getting around to legalizing tetrahydrocannabinol? Do you feel stressed out all of the time and see online radio as your only outlet for stress relief? Well, come on down to Twitty's Paint Emporium. Hi, I'm Twitty Atkins, owner of Twitty's Paint Emporium, and I'm here to invite you to sniff out a great deal on your next can of paint so you can have your way to happiness. Glass paint, satin paint, floor paint, wall paint, whatever you're looking for, we have it here. But don't take my word for it. Here's what some of our loyal customers have to say. Yeah, like the black paint, the spray paint, you know what I'm talking about? I don't know, man. It's just, I mean, it's like the same feeling, kind of, but uh, it's different. It's like every other kind of drug you take, you know? Uh, paint. Uh, uh, paint. More than that. And... Yeah. And I know what you're thinking. Tweety, doesn't having paint give you brain damage? Let's ask our number one customer. Brain damage? What are you talking about brain damage? Alright, here we go. <laughs> so come on down to Tweety's Paint Emporium today and have your way to happiness. Unit 420 on 69th Street, next to Raven's Fish and Chip Shop. Or give us a call on 516-453-9903, where our operators are standing by to take your order. Twinnies Paint Emporium. Oh, sweet Celestia. That's the stuff. You know what? You bitch, you bitch horse. Get that bitch horse out of here with this freaking paint crap. Damn it! I am so sick of this whole goddamn paint crap that's going on on the show. Stop huffing paint! Stop huffing paint! Stop promoting huffing paint, for Christ's sake! You know what that crap does? It kills your goddamn brain cells, boy! It kills your goddamn brain cells! Jesus Christ, give me the back of my mind. It kills your goddamn brain cells, boy. Yeah, 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 that's that's very funny for Christ's sake. You know what? I'm not digging this fucking show. I'm out of here. All right? I'm not joking. I'm not, I'm not, you look, uh, look, I'm going to take one more goddamn radio graffiti caller, and if it sucks, I'm gone. All right? I don't need to be putting up with this crap from you freaking idiots. All right? Jesus Christ. Anonymous Radio Graffiti, Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. Now, folks, if you haven't known, I'm tired of dealing with my wife, all right? She's acting like she wants to be a leftist, AIDS-infected-looking nutcase. It's something about that face. This broad looks like she smokes like at least three and a half packs a day, all right? And that's why I'm telling each and every one of you, uh, because I don't think she knows that she's a... Stupid, dumb, imbecilic bimbo, all right? And moreover, folks, she even said that she didn't want to be partners. What does that mean? Partners, for Christ's sake. Screw partners. I mean, this is getting serious now. You know what I told you this damn... I, didn't I say this months ago that this wasn't going to end? Yeah, yeah, all right, we get it. All right, yeah, yeah, splicing me, making fun of my wife, talking yeah, real funny, real original. I mean, Jesus Christ. Anyway, we are now in the third and final hour of the True Capitalist Radio broadcast. And, of course, I'm your host, the man they call Ghost. Yada, yada, yada. Look, I don't want to do this show. I still got to do another goddamn hour of this stupid piece of garbage. I'm serious, man. And look at Twilly Atkins. You want to fight? Bring it. Not even kidding. Are you kidding me, Twilly? 
Or you're a woman. I will slap you silly, and then you know what? They'll charge me with domestic violence because I slapped a stupid bitch horse in the face. Oh, yeah, I said T.C. Oregon. Well, you know what? Who cares? All right, the Saturday Night Troll Show, Saturday Night Troll Show, Saturday Night Troll Show, Saturday Let me just take the fucking... <laughs> just take the fucking hit and shut up. I'm angry, man! I'm pissed off! I don't even want to do this show, man! I don't want to do it! I don't even want to do it, man. Anonymous Radio Graffiti. Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. All right. I'm calling my wife. All right, I got the number. So go ahead and call him, engineer. Hi, honey. How you doing? Oh, my God! Uh, I'm, I'm glad you're dead, you know? I'm glad my wife is dead. I'm glad you're dead. I'm lolling right now. I'm happy. <laughs> Lol, you died. Oh, damn it, Twilly Atkins, you bitch. Horse. You bitch horse. goddamn day off. That's what I should have done. I just should have taken the damn stupid son of a bitch and cock a duty day off. <sighs> Jesus Christ. I should have taken the cock a duty day off, man. Good God, man. I'm just, I'm sick. I'm sick of this crap. I'm emotionally drained, man. I shouldn't have even a freaking... Come here. All right, who do we have here? How about uh, anonymous radio graffiti? Twilly Atkins radio graffiti. Him and then Hello? Hello? You've got to help me. He's been missing for two days now. Okay, who is? My daddy. He's, he's called Thomas. Thomas Albert. But everyone calls him Ghost. He got, he got really mad at me on Wednesday. You see, he presents a radio show called True Capitalist Radio. And, and he ended up calling me a bitch. And then he disappeared. I, I need you to send some officers out. I'm really worried about him. I'm, I'm at in, in San Antonio. Okay, I want you to stand around with me and, you know, until the police get there in case anything happens. Okay, but you gotta find him. He doesn't usually disappear like this. He just took off. He could be anywhere by now. What kind of car does he drive? He doesn't. He's in a wheelchair, but, but when I checked, his hovering was missing. Please, you gotta help me find him. I get it. They're gonna be on the way. I just want to stay on the phone with you until the officers get there, okay? Uh, okay, thank you. What does he look like? Well, he's about 420 pounds. He's, he's really short, and, and he kind of looks like Alex Jones, but, but like fatter. Is he white, black, tan, he? He's white. Does he normally carry any weapons at all? Yeah, he, he's got a gun. He keeps telling everyone he's going to get into bar fights as well. That's why he calls himself Ghost. He keeps telling everyone he's a dangerous man. He had the police visit him before, and he pulled the gun out on them. Okay, where is the gun actually? Is it locked up? No, he tends to carry it on his tripod. you got to help. I'm really worried about him. Okay. okay. I have several officers on the way. I swear to God, after making us all so sick with worry, I mean, I'm so scared, but I'm so mad at him, you know? Okay, just, okay, just calm down, okay? We don't want to do anything too rash. I mean... Where are the officers? Where, where are the officers? I need to find him. I miss him so much. I know, and it feels like forever, and it's only been two minutes. Okay, please come soon. Willie Atkins, you sick bitch! Where in the hell did 
did you send the cops, you damn bitch horse? Where in the hell did you send those cops? Oh, my God. Did you all hear that, man? Did you all hear that? That's not funny, man. That's not funny whatsoever. Son of a bitch. Give me that. Stupid goddamn brony bitch. Jesus Christ. Who else do we have here, for Christ's sake, man? Good God. And without further ado, let's go ahead and tweet it out right now. All right. Now, this is the Saturday Night Troll Show merch exclusively for everybody that listens to this broadcast, baby. All right. I just tweeted it now. Just tweeted it right now. And this is for all the folks that are out there partaking in this, this every Saturday night broadcast. The Saturday Night Troll Show. This is for you, trolls! Even though you besmirch me, even though you troll me, even though you make my life a living hell! I still got a soft spot. Soft spot. Soft spot! Jesus Christ, I can't even talk! I got a soft spot for you morons. I got a soft spot for you. Yeah. I got a soft spot for you all. Somebody's saying that's the ugliest one I've ever seen. Yeah, that's what a troll looks like, you dumbass. What do you think? A troll is supposed to look like a nice little pretty thing, huh, Twilly Atkins, you stupid, dumb, freaking whore horse? Huh? Is that it? Huh? Is everybody supposed to look like a little stupid, little uh, fruity-ass, faggy, little white horse like you? Shut up and go in the kitchen where you belong. Nobody asks you shit. How about anonymous radio graffiti? Anyway, folks, let's get to the bottom of the show here. I'm going to have an affair. You know, with the cupcake broad. All right? So I want to just go ahead and put that on the record. All right? And, no, you and, know and, what? And shut that off. Shut things. up! I never said that. That's a splice. You <laughs> son of a bitch. I'm not going to have a cupcake broad. <laughs> you see, that's another thing, man. That's another thing with you people. That's another thing. You know, I can't even be candid with you people about certain aspects of my life without you people making some big goddamn joke about it. You understand? Making some big goddamn joke about it. Good God. Give me that mic. I'm serious, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Making some big goddamn joke about it, man. I'm telling you, people are pieces of crap. <sighs> Anonymous radio graffiti. Twilly Atkins radio graffiti. And, 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 and I want to also say this. That the reason that maybe Cupcake Lady, you know, wants the old ghost special, and who would blame her, is because, folks, my wife looks like she smokes like at least three and a half packs a day. All right? So, as a result... I'm going to get a freaking divorce. I'm not even kidding around, man. Spread it around like wildfire and let everybody know that I am going to get a divorce. <laughs> oh, man, I feel good. Yeah, you know what? Good. Shove it up, your goddamn twat. Piece of crap. I should have hung up right when I heard that stupid, dumb bitch horse name. I should have hung up. I should have hung up, but no, I, you know, I'm a nice guy. You know that? I'm a nice guy. I'm a little too nice. Give me the damn mic. You know, maybe I'm a little too nice. Maybe that's my problem. You know, that? maybe that's my goddamn problem. President Trump is in power, baby. How about anonymous radio graffiti? Twilly Atkins radio graffiti. Happy birthday, Twilly Atkins. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. 
Wheelie Atkins. No, 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 you bitch horse! And enough of the bronies, all right? It's bad enough that you bronies are using the girl from Ipanema and your damn brony movie. Shut up your ass! Jesus Christ, man. You know, I'm just so tired. I'm tired. I'm tired of this. This is supposed to be my Halloween comeback. 352 Radio Graffiti. Good morning, Vietnam. Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. Let me get my freaking gun. Let me get my freaking gun out of here, for Christ's sake. I'm not going to let you win. I'm not letting you goddamn win. I'm telling you this right now. I'm not I'm not taking it out alive. Left wig in Hanoi. Don't talk about being fucking Left wigs at Saigon Strip Club. Shit. <laughs> No, you want to continue on, right? You want to sit over here, you want to continue to talk about it, yap about it like you were there, for Christ's sake. Like you were in the right, Patty, seeing Charlie. Good God. Who else do we have here? We got butt hurt Patty Ghost. Lost hair in rice patties. Uh, Why don't you all just shut up? Don't you dare talk about him. Shut her. You know, shut that bitch horse Twilly Atkins up. Shut her up! Shut her up! Shut that stupid bitch horse up! Shut her up! I, I don't know how many times I gotta tell you people I don't want to talk about Viet fucking now! Give me the damn money. I don't want to talk about it! All right. I'm gonna calm down here for a second. And I'm going to try to continue with the rest of Radio Graffiti without too much of a problem. And let me tell you, you keep this up, man. I'm going to, I'm going to end the broadcast, all right? You, you think I'm lying? I've done it before. I'll do it again. Anonymous Radio Graffiti. Hey, Ghost. It's Twitty here. I guess I've been giving you a lot of shtick about being bald lately. Don't worry, though. I put together a video that will solve everything. Go check your notifications on Gap and let me know what you think. Oh, you know what? I, I'm not going to do that. I know I know you. I know you, you bitch horse. I know you. First of all, enough of the bald jokes. And secondly, okay, I'm going to take a listen to this Twilly Atkins little video, okay? That's what I'm going to do, this little Twilly Atkins video. And see what the hell, you know, she's talking about here, all right? So let's go ahead. Hey, engineer, put the little Twilly Atkins video on because apparently Twilly Atkins did this, all right? Put it on, engineer. Yeah, what the hell is this? Do you find yourself worrying about those balding or thinning areas? I am bald! Then you need Miracle Hair, the 60-second all-in-one hair solution for men and women. Just sprinkle Miracle Hair on the thinning or balding areas you want to cover, and you'll have the appearance of a full head of hair. This time last oh, footage shows Miracle Christ. Hair being applied to thinning areas, giving the appearance of a full head of hair in just 60 seconds. Just look at these results, and you'll understand why Miracle Hair is flying Oh, off the my show. God, give me a break! Smart Fiber Technology, featuring all-natural statically charged hair-like fibers that bond to your actual hair follicles, covering those problem areas and making you look years younger. Too good to be true? Well, check out these first-time reactions. For those of you that just don't know... All right, I'm some balding cripple pothole. Like a two-ball ghost. Miracle hair is sweat-resistant, wind-resistant. Plus, it comes in six different colors and works on all types of hair. God damn it. I'm Donald Trump, and I approve this message. You son of a bitch! Damn it, Wheelie! Ah, damn it! You bitch horse! Ah. I freaking knew it! I freaking knew you were gonna post some crap like that! Look at my gab! Check out my gab right now, politics scope! I just reposted what this bitch horse just got good! Screw you! Screw you! Screw you! I'm not bald, you asshole! I'm not bald! Do you understand that? I'm not bald, you asshole! I'm not bald! I'm not freaking bald! 
Give me the freaking Look at my goddamn dad. I, 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 I'm not freaking bald. Shut up about that sh crap. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Five minutes left. Thank God. Anonymous radio goddamn totally graffiti. Acting. Radio graffiti. What, did you fall asleep? Is this asshole snoring? He fell asleep? How the hell can you fall asleep to the true capitalist radio show? A few moments earlier. Oh, yeah. We found out recently that ridiculous Russian P do the PP do dossier. You remember? You remember that little Russian dossier where supposedly Donald Trump liked golden showers? I'm just going to leave it at that. Remember that stupid, ridiculous crap? But uh, somebody from the Hillary Clinton goon uh, circle there actually paid for the Russian dossier, actually paid for the Russian dossier, and did you hear what Hillary Clinton's response to that was? Well, I mean, there's nothing illegal about getting information about your opponent. I mean, isn't that what Donald yeah, You know what, you know what, if you are that bored, then turn off my broadcast, you ungrateful piece of trash! <laughs> with Ghostbusters. He's a choke artist. He chokes. You can't do that. And he did it in front of Chris Christie. I've never seen anything like that. I was standing right next to him. I look over. I say, are you okay? But uh, he, uh, he really, we can't have a choke artist. You know, one thing I've learned from Texas, when you're a choker, you're always a choker. We can't have that. We can't take any chances in this country. You son of a bitch. never say that about me. Donald Trump would never, I mean, he would never say that about me. So shove it up your ass. Bitch horse. Give me the mic. 
Jesus Christ. <sighs> Pissing me off already, for Christ's sake. Anonymous Radio Graffiti. It's where we at in Radio Graffiti. Fort in New. Texas and Fort your Lone Star. Star. Beer. <laughs> Woo! Fort Matt. Fort King and Fort Cologne Overseer. Fort you stupid bitch horse. Damn it. God damn it, man. I'm tired of this forking, man. Fork this, fork that. Fork you! Fork you! Jesus Christ, give me the mic. Give me the, give me the freaking mic, man. You, we're already starting off bad. We're already starting off bad. Anonymous Radio Graffiti, Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. If you are calling from a touch tone phone, please press one. If you are calling from a rotary dial phone, please. If you would like to leave a comment for the president. What the hell was that? It, it, it dropped. If you'd like to leave a message for the president, what the hell? Why'd you, why'd you, why did you goddamn hang up, Twilly, you dumb bitch horse? Anonymous Radio Graffiti. We got Scarlet Moon and Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. I was working at the con late one night when my eyes beheld an awkward sight. For a brony in the corner, a cowboy, Stood and pulled out his plushy toy. He did the clock. He did the brony clock. The brony clock. It caused my jaw to drop. He did the clock. I say he goes needs to stop. He did the clock. He did the brony clock. From my vantage point at the side of the con to the pale white skeleton who was plopping on. His grip did loosen, his wrist became lax, as Gus stood there starting to climax. He did the clock. He did the brony clock. The brony clock. It caused my job. Hey, get, get this brony cancer. from a rotary dial phone, please. If you would like to leave a comment for the president, please press one. If you are calling for the White House mailing address or the fax number, please press two. Line, good morning. What state are you calling from, please? I am the man they call ghost of the True Capitalist Radio broadcast. Uh, can, may I ask you, please, what state you're calling from? I'm a brick-mortar business owner. It's in Hambonio, Texas! Oh, thank you. All right, and I can take your comment. Do we happen to have that pause hole? President Trump on the horn. No, we don't have any way of connecting you with the president, sir. We just take policy comments here. 
I can take a message for you. Donald Trump, you're an anti-American traitor! I'm sick of seeing that idiot's face, man! This power bottom, tranny loving piece of crap, he tried to do everything within his power to destroy this country, man. Because he knows his scumbag, homosexual, power bottom ass is a freaking traitor. And if you don't see that, then you hate this country just as much as he does. And you're a piece of crap. Okay. Well, I'll just, um, I can't uh, confirm anything. I, all, all we do is take a comment here, as I say. Sorry, I can't help you more. For you! And for Donald Trump. Are you kidding me, you stupid bitch horse? You called my president, and you good, you stupid fraud! Ah, I hate you! God damn it, whoever that stupid bitch horse is, I hope the spirit of Ike Turner lays the smack it down on your stupid ass! I hope you get cancer of the uterus, you stupid... Trump 
He grabbed me by the pussy and hit slightly on the roof. I want to take you back to a Christmas. He told the Mrs. Ghost to my dear. From Santa Claus this year, I only want one toy. I cast your body panel that will bring me lots of joy. I can see me now on Christmas morning, clapping on the stairs. I was screaming when I was squirt as I'm lifting up my skirt to see a sucky ghosty lying there. I want to deck you up to a Christmas. Uh, you know what? Yeah, I, I don't want to hear it. Why are you doing this, you freaking bitch horse? Why are you doing <laughs> Christ, man. Hey, you know what? I want a, I want a woman check. On Twilly over here, right? I, I want a woman. I don't think that's a man, baby. That's a man, baby. That ain't no goddamn bro. That's a man, baby. Give me a man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You know what? I could speak. I, I could sound finer than you there. All right, uh, Twilly, I could think you're a chef. Hello? Uh, I could talk like this too, you know? Uh huh. I'm Twilly Atkins, and I'm just such a bitch horse. Stupid, man. Freaking stupid. Now, with that being said, let's go ahead and get to some of the ghosties, shall we? Anyway, folks, let's go ahead and move on to the next category in the ghosties, folks. It is the best remix. The best remix, folks. And this was a very, very tough, very tough category. Uh, but I do want to give some honorable mentions out there before everybody starts getting a little butt hurt, before start people start getting pissed off and saying, Go, that's not fair. Nah, 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 nah. So we're gonna we're gonna give a couple of honorable mentions over here, okay? Now, first and foremost, uh as I stated, it was a very, very tough decision for these uh best remix winners and Honorable mentions, but, uh, you know, you got to do what you have to do. The show must go on, and uh, you've got to be able to choose the winners and losers, etc. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and listen to another honorable mention. And this one right here is made by that bitch horse, Twilly Atkins. And this one is called, uh, Jesus Christ. Ride the White Horse. Okay, folks? Uh, for you folks that are unaware, uh, she remixed the uh, the song Ride the White Horse with yours truly's voice in it. So this is an honorable mention, Ride the White Horse, by the bitch horse herself, Twilly Atkins. Let's go ahead and put it on. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to pretend I'm at a bar here, all right? And you know what? You know what, you, you, you dumbass, uh, you know, you know, you bronies, you CIA bronies out there, all right? Let's put on a song for you stupid dumbass spooks, all right? I'm going to pretend that I'm at a bar here, and let me tell you, since I got a lot of you brony CIA bastards, let's put a horse head song on. How about that? You know, and let me tell you, this is a song that was really, really popular back in about 83, 84. You know what I mean? I mean, you went to any disco at that point in time, baby. I mean, you know, uh, women were shaking their assets to this particular song, baby. You understand what I'm saying? All right. I'm not joking around. So let, without any further ado, let's go ahead. You got the, the, the song engineer? All right, let's go ahead and put it on here, right? What do we have here? Twilly Atkins Radio Graffiti. Do you want to ride? Ride the white horse. Do you want to ride? Ride the white horse. White horse. Ride the white horse. White horse. Ride the white horse. No, no, no! Ride the white horse. No, no, no! Ride the white horse. Do you want to ride? Ride the white horse. 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 Ride the white hor
a white horse? Do you wanna ride? Ride the white horse. Do you wanna ride? Ride the white horse. Do you wanna ride? Ride the white horse. White horse. Ride the white horse. White horse. Ride the white horse. No, no, no. Ride the white horse. No, no, no. Ride the white horse. If you want to be a horse, you've got to be a horse. Be a horse. Shut up, you twat! If you want to be a rich horse, you've got to be a rich horse. Be a rich horse. Rich horse. Be a rich horse. You rich horse. God. Do you want to ride? Ride the white pony. True Capitalist Radio in the top ten pony videos. You know, I mean, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to say to that? What am I supposed to say to that? Ride. Ride the white pony. White pony. White pony. Uh, all right, shut that crap. Shut it off. All right, we get that honorable mention as well. Once again, Twilly Atkins. Do you want to ride? Ride the white horse. Uh, that is an honorable mention remix. Now, with that being said, folks, we're going to continue on. We're going to continue on with the category of best trans testicle, okay? And, and who's the honorable mention, Twilly Atkins? Honorable mention, Twilly Atkins. <laughs> honorable mention, Twilly Atkins. <laughs> oh, oh. Right now. <laughs> All right, who do we got here? 
And there's Twilly Atkins. What's going on, Twilly Atkins? Haven't seen you since uh, the New Year's Eve show. We've got Twilly Atkins in the place. Uh, we've got Twilly Atkins. Uh, Twilly Atkins. There's Twilly Atkins. Yeah, Twilly Atkins. Uh, we got Twilly Atkins. We've got, uh, I'm not going to say that disgusting name. What's going on to Twilly Atkins? What's going on to Twilly Atkins? Twilly Atkins in the house. Anyway, we got Twilly Atkins in the house. What's going on? Uh, we've got, uh, there's Twilly Atkins, for Christ's sake. No, please, man, let, let's, uh, team optimism! Uh, we've got Twilly Atkins. We got, uh, we got Twilly Atkins. Oh, uh, there's Twilly. We got Twilly Atkins. There's Twilly Atkins. Yeah, I really like that, that, uh, do you want to ride? Ride a white horse. Yeah, I really like that there, Twilly, a freaking Bitch horse. Anyway, we've got Twilly Atkins. There's Twilly Atkins for Christ's sake. And hey, Twilly, is that? I mean, are you? Is are you? Really, you really have that much Johnny Walker, Twilly? Good God! Oh, Jesus Christ, man! And, and look, are you kidding me? Look at Twilly Atkins. Look, I'm about to retweet Twilly. Look at that Johnny Walker collection, man. And that's Twilly Atkins. That's a white bitch horse, all right? And look at that. Look at that. Good God, she's slapping all of you guys. Oh, God. Look at Twilly, man. Look at that collection. I mean, we got bronies now partaking in the finer things in life now, huh? We got bronies partaking in the finer libations in life. Is this it? Look at the Twitter account, folks. I'm not even joking, man. Good God. Give me the mic. Give me the mic. I mean, what, what does that say about you people, huh? I mean, you got a brony over here. You got a brony over here that's just literally a... T- All right, I've had enough. All right, I'm not, I'm not paying attention to Twitter or Gab or any of that crap. I can already see that you people are... are, are you're trying to antagonize me. You're trying to... Uh, I'm, just, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. We got Twilly Atkins... What's going on a Twilly? Uh, do you want to ride? Ride a white horse. White horse. Anyway, we got Twilly Atkins. What's going on? We got Twilly Atkins. We've got Twilly Atkins. Who else do we have here? We got uh, Twilly Atkins in the place. Uh, we've got uh, Twilly Atkins in the house. Twilly Atkins. We got Twilly Atkins. Uh, we've got, uh, Twilly Atkins. Anyway, we got Twilly Atkins in the house. There's, uh, this bitch horse, uh, Twilly Atkins. There's Twilly Atkins. Yeah, that's great. We've got Twilly Atkins, that bitch horse. Jesus Christ, man. We got, there's Twilly Atkins. Oh, that's great. We got Twilly Atkins. Who else do we have here? Twilly, A- Twilly Atkins. What, 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 what are you doing here? Thought we got rid of you! Stupid bitch horse. Alright, we got uh, Twilly Atkins. Oh, here's that bitch horse. Who else do we have here, for heaven's sake? Uh, I'm not saying these sick names. There's bitch horse Twilly Atkins. I mean, there's Twilly Atkins. There's, uh, there's, uh, there's Twilly Atkins. Yeah, they were great. Stupid idiots. We got uh, Twilly Atkins, that bitch horse. I'm only going to take a couple of There's Twilly Atkins, the bitch horse. Great. Great to see you here on Christmas Eve. Stupid broad. I don't even think you're a broad. I think you're a transgendered. I think you're, I think you're just, I think you're a transgendered. I don't think you're a, a chick at all. You, that sounds like such a put on voice. I mean, it sounds like such a put on voice when you try to do those stupid songs. We can't even hear you. I'm a bitch 
Barsa. <laughs> Stupid, dumb broad. Get in the kitchen if you are a broad. If not... If you're a tranny, well, then get on the stroll and make me some money, you dumb, stupid, transgender, trans-testicle piece of crap. We got Twilly Atkins. That was a former winner of, uh, I believe, last year's most failed troll of the year. Let's see if that piece of crap wins anything. That bitch horse. Anyway, who else do we have here? We got Twilly for prison, 2017. Jeez, what the hell that mean? Jesus Christ, man. We got Deplorable Atkins. Uh, we've got uh, TCR Top Pony Vids for January. Oh, I saw that. I don't even want to acknowledge it, okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm Top Pony Vid for January 2017. What an accomplishment. I don't even want to acknowledge it, so don't even make a goddamn name about it. Jesus Christ, man. I'm getting infested by bronies. Ghost of Brony confirm? No, sh- shut that crap up your ass. What are you talking about? Ghost Brony confirmed. You're, you're freaking wet, stupid, horse-humping dreams, you dumbasses. What are you talking about? What the hell are you talking You wish. All right, you bronies and your clopping freak show fantasies wish. Uh, you wish. And, you know, I noticed that all you bronies now are now calling yourself agent now, and you're putting, like, glasses over yourself and, and on, on your avatar. I'm, I'm looking at this, huh? You think it's a big joke that the CIA is... Uh, you, you know what? You know, they, they have weaponized autism, haven't they? The CIA has weaponized autism! They've weaponized autism! I mean, I'm sitting over here telling the bronies that it, they could be just completely under a CIA psyop with the utilization of psychotronic technology mixed with neuro-linguistic hypnosis. And here they are. Look at these. Look at these people. Look at them. They're like, uh, my name is Agent Twilly Atkins. Agent Atkins reporting for duty. I mean, are you kidding me, you bronies? You're under a CIA PSYOP, for Christ's sake. And, oh, yeah, did y'all see that tweet? Remember yesterday we um, found the server Big Bronies in the code of some of these cyber weapons? Huh? Yeah, oh, yeah, I mean, that that seems to be some big data dumping site. BigBronies.com. Well, if you go to BigBronies.com, it redirects you to a website ran by... None other than Evan McMuffin, or excuse me, Evan McMullen, all right? This was the CIA operative that attempted to run against Trump, all right, and for whatever reason continues to meddle in uh, to the political system. Uh, uh, this, uh, what, Evan McMullen, Scott, no, whatever the hell is stupid name, I don't really care what his name is. He's a freak show. I mean, this goes to show you. That this freaking McMullen, this Evan McMullen guy, is a brony. I'm telling you, you bronies are being psyop, you stupid horse humpers. You're being psyop, for Christ's sake. Sitting over here trying to, you know, uh, make it a big joke, right? Make it a big joke over here. Uh, this is Agent, uh, this is Agent Pony Ass over here. All right, Agent Pony Ass with the CIA. Look, I'm not joking around. I mean, the CIA, I mean, we were finding out that these damn agents out here are, I mean, not only affiliated with bronyism, I mean, anime, tohu, I mean, I mean, we've got them connected to freaking role-playing chat more. I mean, just good God. I mean, the cyber division of the CIA is a bunch of fat, disgusting, weaponized autism. Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. You know what, CIA? You should be ashamed of yourself, all right? Seriously, you should be ashamed of yourself. I'm not even joking. Look, look at us. Uh, I'm not even going to retweet that. I'm not giving you... Bro- you bronies think it's a big joke. I'm telling you, y'all, y'all are being... <laughs> Y'all are being psyop, and you know what? They have weaponized autism, the CIA. They have weaponized autism. It's official! It's official!
they weaponized autism, for Christ's sake, man. You should be ashamed of yourself, CIA. But, of course, you have no shame. Oh, God, you'll kill your own you kill your own freaking people for Christ's sake. You kill your own mother if the agency told you to for Christ's sake. Good God. Here's Agent Pony ass. How long did that take? Yeah, how long how long did that take for Christ's sake? Here's Agent Swartz. Oh yeah, here here's Agent Scarlet Moon. Yeah, here we go. The bronies are all look at this. Oh yeah, they think it's a big joke. I mean, they've been, their autism has been weaponized by the CIA, and they think it's a big goddamn joke. Look at that crap. That's just great. That's just great. Uh, We've got, uh, well, Agent Atkins. Oh, yeah, yeah, you see, you bronies, I mean, I know that y'all are taking this as a big joke, but you all have been psyop. Do you understand me? I mean, each and every one of you bronies and your enemies and your tohus, you've been PSYOP by the CIA! And I've alluded to this, folks. I believe that CIA has weaponized autism uh, with bronies and all this. I'm not joking around. I mean, it has been uncovered, folks, that these goddamn agents are bronies. I'm talking about the CIA Internet Division. Uh, They're bronies. They're bronies, for Christ's sake, man. And all the bronies out here, they're, you know, uh, my little pony, my little pony. I mean, all y'all that are watching that, y'all are being psyoped. Jesus Christ, you scumbags, man. Agent Scarlet Smith, oh, that's cute. That's fresh. The Brony Intelligence Agency, shut up. Don't even go there, you stupid bronies. Don't you understand? They've weaponized your autism. They've weaponized your autism, for Christ's sake. And you don't even know it. You don't even know it. We got agent silent capital. Look, enough with the bronies and agents, and and now you bronies are putting freaking glasses on your avatars. You think it's a big freaking joke? And look, here's somebody, big brony here, big ass. Shut up! Look, you dumbass bronies, this is not funny. This is not a joke, you stupid tards. You understand me? This is serious business. You dumbass, this is serious business. We've got Agent Havoc. Uh, here's another agent, for Christ's sake. We've got the Brony Network. Uh, we've got oh, My Little Pony. Is this the official My Little Pony? Uh, Jesus Christ, man. My Little Pony, My Little Pony, My Little Pony. Look, I, I think BronyCon is coming around the corner. Isn't that right? It's like in May or something, right? I think I, I, think I might send some uh, correspondence out there uh, to the uh, BronyCon out there. I think, I think, I'm gonna, I, I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to send some, some correspondence, and uh, we're going to call ourselves the correspondence out there. We're going to call ourselves the, the Four Horsemen. All right, the four horsemen of the BronyCon. That's what we're going to do. The four horsemen, baby. We're going to throw up the four fingers in the air, baby. Four horsemen, baby! Anyway, I don't know what I'm talking about. Look, look I'm only going to take a couple more Gab shout-outs, and then we're going to move on to the remainder of the broadcast, all right? Good, good Lord, man. And look, there's My Little Pony. What is this the is this the official My Little Pony on Gab now, huh? My little pony, my little pony, ah, little pony. Uh, we've got NG rides white horse. You shut up, all right, man. Just shut up. Oh, great, My Little Pony. Huh? My little pony, my little pony. Jesus Christ. Here's a My Little Pony. Oh, my God. Let me tell you something about My Little Pony, okay? First of all, did you know that there's a freaking brony movie out right now? My Little Pony movie. And did you know, on a side footnote, that they used the girl from Impanema in the goddamn brony movie? Huh? No one even gave a crap about the girl from Impanema. Until I started using it on this broadcast. So, I'm, I look, I, I don't even want to know if I had anything to do with that, because if I did, I, I'm ashamed of it. If I did, I'm ashamed of it. All right? 
anyway, who I'm only gonna, I'm only going to take a couple more of these, and I'm getting the hell. I'm, I'm not. I'm, I'm. I mean, these are getting stupid, man. These are getting ridiculous. Jesus Christ! Let's go back to the freaking radio graffiti, so that you know these people can you know I can add some significance to losers' lives. Oh man, I'm so proud of myself. I mean, I'm telling you, I, I'm really I've really accomplished something in life, haven't I? Freaking gay club music, anonymous radio, goddamn graffiti, J man capitalist radio graffiti. All those in the inner circle. Let's go ahead and start taking some Twitter shootouts of you ungrateful little twats. We've got Sneak Man, Glass Master, T Stoner, King Ed, Tech Capitalist, The Stilling Pub Guy, Godzilla, Peter Pitt, Snow White, Panda Man, Mexican, Bag, Venison, Mike, Smack Hack, Ace, Lizzie Jones, Karaskin, want to give a shout out to uh Trulli Atkins and the um what's his name? Oh yeah, uh Buzz Aldrin's grandson. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me, seriously? Get, this idiot. Get him out of here. I knew it. Yeah. I fucking knew That's it. A I fake, fucking knew that it. That was a fake mask Christ, pony. You troll bastards. He got God damn troll time. bastards, man. Good God, man. Lay off the Whatever you're smoking, man. Anonymous radio graffiti. Twilly Atkins radio graffiti. Now, folks, if you haven't known, I'm tired of dealing with my wife, all right? She's acting like she wants to be a leftist, AIDS-infected-looking nutcase. It's something about that face. This broad looks like she smokes like Look, at least we three already and a heard that, a Twilly, day. all right? We already all heard right. it. Shut up! You stupid, dumb bitch whore. Shut up! Anonymous Radio Graffiti. Twilly Atkins, that, that, that was my troll. I, I was the one that did that. Twilly Atkins took that recording and she replaced it with her voice. She stole that troll from me, that stupid dumb bitch horse. 
Oh yeah. Well, well what? What? Well, how, how did you call? Did you sound like that? Sound like Twilly? No, no, no. That wasn't me. I did. I did a separate recording, and Twilly took my recording, took out my voice, and put in her own. Yeah. Well. Uh, I mean, why don't you go? Why don't you go give her a smack or something? For Christ's sake! I mean, what do you want me to do about it? Huh? I want you to go give her a give her a shot or something. Go give her a slap or do something. What do you want me to do about it? How about six four seven radio graffiti? God damn remix! Shut that remix off! Shut it off! I just freaking said that for Christ's sake, and I'm tired of the remixes and turn it off! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it. Give me the mic! I can't believe that you idiots. I, I, just, I just can't believe you. I can't believe you idiots! And, folks, I've just kept going and going because you fans keep listening. And when I mean fans, I mean everybody. I'm not just talking about those that like to listen to the crypto and the stock markets, not just those that just like to listen to the politics, but all you guys out there, even you trolls out there that like to listen to Gab, and the Gab shout-outs, and those of you that like the radio graffiti. I mean, I do it for you. I, I, you guys are the most dedicated fans in Internet fandom, and I appreciate you guys for it. I know sometimes you get me a little crazy, you get me a little pissed off at times, but I definitely want to say that I'm thankful for each and every one of you. I, I'm thankful for you guys listening I'm thankful for you guys in every way that you support this show. And to be honest with you, man, that's why I do it. I do it to spark synapses in the brains of capitalists and uh, attempt to uh, provide entertainment to those that uh, would otherwise not be listening to politics or economics. So with that being said, I want to say cheers to everyone who listens to this broadcast. I'm out of here, boy.